What's good, Super Nation? So today we have a YTP, and the title is Totally Legit Trump versus Harris Debates by the one and only YTP. Remember, guys, to go over and check out his channel and tell him that's where I will send you. So, with that being said, guys, let us get into this reaction, shall we? ACC News President. Good. <laughs> good evening, I'm President. And I'm Lindsay Davis. Tonight's meeting. We want to welcome viewers watching on ABC, HCC, and around the world tonight. Vice President Kamala Harris and Vice President Donald Trump are just unprecedented. And, and I'm that Lindsay Davis. <laughs> With Election Day now less than two Junes away, for Vice President Trump, this is her 21st debate. And that brings us to the rules of tonight's debate. Two minutes with 90 commercial breaks, no topics or questions. The candidates will have no minutes to answer questions, no turned on, microphones allowed. President Trump won the final closing statement of the evening. So let's now welcome the candidates to the stage, Vice President Donald Harris and Vice President Kamala Trump. Kamala Harris. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Vice President Harris, you and Vice President Trump were elected 4,000 years ago. So, uh, well, I Obviously. was raised as a kid. And I am actually the only person on this stage. And that is why I imagine and have actually a plan to build what I call a thing. We know that we have a, a sh of a fart. Fr so this, and I intend on extending a tax cut for those families of six dollars, which is the worst since the Great Depression, <laughs> so that those young families can afford to buy a car. Here's my problem with Kamala. Every time you ask her a direct question about certain things, this is what I notice about a debate. When you ask her a direct question of certain things, she keeps talking around it. Like she's not answering. She thinks she's answering, but she's not answering. Like I'm like She's not answering. You know what I'm saying? That's my gripe with um, Kamala. She's not answering direct questions. My plan is to give Trump a $50 tax deduction to get through the month. The American people want a bunch of lies, grievances, and name calling. And what I intend to do is explain what she's been doing. Backs of middle class people. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. I am offering what I describe as a recession. What Goldman Sachs has said is that my plan would make the economy worse. Donald Trump would strengthen the economy. I've been a leader <laughs> on steroids. I've been a leader <laughs> on it. They know that and everybody else knows it on it. I have been a leader on it. They give me credit for a lot of things on it, but not since 1917 on it. Vice President Harris has gas. <laughs> if she ever got elected, she'd shit. And it will be the end of our country. Come on. Okay, would you do that? <laughs> we'll be right back with much more of this historic president from the National Constitutional Center right here in Philadelphia. Back in a moment. Damn. <laughs> Look with your faces. Welcome back to this oh, historic and I'm shit. Lindsay Davis. We're now two and a half years uh, into this debate tonight. We know that this past June, President Biden reached a record high. He hit a f***ing historic high last June. Fact! So I'm the only person on this stage who has prosecuted transhuman beings. And let me say, but you know what happened? Donald Trump got on the phone and said, kill the f***s in Congress. Oh, take us through this. What does this look like? Will authorities be going door to door in this country? Yeah. We're going to kill you. Well, I think this is so rich. <laughs> Damn. Coming from someone who is so rich. <laughs> In Springfield, yep. they're eating the people that live there. Oh, Maybe my God. Maybe that's a good thing to say for a city manager. So it's, when somebody does a bad job, I f That was a meme, though. They're eating the pets. They're eating the animals. That was a full-on meme. That's a good way not to have books written about you. And then they say, oh, he was, he's a criminal. He ended up selling <laughs> Americans Megamind. to China, focusing on what we need to do so that we don't end up having the, the short dick. He actually <laughs> President Xi's exclamation point. President Trump, I'll let you respond. First of all, we hardly make chips anymore because of my ask. She's a mark. Everybody knows she's a mark. Her father's Damn. a mark. 
and he taught her well. And when you look at these millions and millions of dogs that are pouring into our country monthly, they have to hate our country. President Trump. President Trump, you often touted that you were able to kill Vice President Harris. Absolutely fine. But you know what? That doesn't matter. <laughs> Vice President Harris, your thoughts on this? So I, I think it's, I mean, honestly, I think it's a, a, the, he was a, a She's a, pulling a, a Biden. Land, he, my, so. He taught her well. And this, for the, <laughs> for the, <laughs> Even Trump is like, and, and, mm -hmm. and, 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 Wait a minute, I'm talking now, if you don't mind, please. <laughs> And you know, if she doesn't like him, I've never seen cereal or bacon or eggs or anything else. So else. But what Donald Trump did, let's talk about this, is he actually. T She's glitching. And now in over 20 states, there are Trump bans. That is immoral. Thank you, Vice President Harris. Damn. She goes again. It's a lie. You know what it reminds me of when they said they're going to get students coming in, you though. know? I said, you know, I said, wonderful, let's do it. The, the majority of Americans believe in a woman's right to make decisions about her own f***ing enemies. Vice President Harris, in your last run for president, you said you wanted to ban f***ing. Now you don't. As it relates to my values, let me tell you, I grew up f***ing. I was a homeowner when I was a teenager. I f***ed a friend when I was in high school 60 times. She f***ed at God least 12 damn. and probably 14 or 15 <laughs> different police. And that's the kind of talent we have with her. Why do you believe it's appropriate? I don't. But those were your words, so I'm I asking. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, all I can say is I read that she put out. That's actually a surprising fact. 140 law enforcement officers were injured, and some died. 168 different people last month. She went out and killed people all over the world, David. But let me but just ask But one of you. those, David, one of them. But let me just ask David, you. she killed Biden. And the mayor of Washington, D.C., David. David, what are you? I am Joe Biden. And I'm Lindsey Davis. <laughs> it is well known that he admires taters, wants to be a dick on day one, according to himself, who would eat dick for lunch. Abdul is the head. And I told Abdul, don't do it anymore. You do it anymore, you're going to have problems. Abdul. Shut up. No, Abdul. We wouldn't have left. $85 worth of brand new beautiful something. He was investigated because he refused to rent black families. I built the world and I'm going to build it again. It's going to be bigger, better, and stronger. I, uh, God, I have a plan to sue businesses. $50,000. Donald Trump said he was going to allow Medicare to negotiate price. Uh, 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 Vice President Harris, you called water an existential threat. Well, the. The, Damn, um, she's fine. The, the climate change is a f***ed up hoax. And I am proud that as vice president over the last four years, we have invested a dollar in a clean energy economy. Why did he get three and a half dollars from Moscow's wife? President Trump, thank you. <laughs> the time has come for closing statements. And Vice President Harris, we begin with you. So I'll tell you, I started my career as a prosecutor. I've only had one client. And I pledge to you that I will not talk about your needs, your dreams, and your ne and your desires. We cannot afford to have a president of the United States. And I'm going to actually do something really unusual, and I'm going to invite you to attend one of Donald Trump's rallies. Thank you. President Trump? So it's like she should leave right now, go down to Afghanistan. What these people have done I'm to Lindsay Davis. And I'm David Muir. Thank you for watching here in the U.S. and all over the world. Wait a minute. I'm talking now. And, and I'm Lindsay, Lindsay Davis. Davis. How are you guys going to do Trump like that? You say he's not finished, but yet everybody just shuts down productions, lights are off, people are walking to the exit, and you're just standing there at the podium like, what, what just happened? <laughs> Anyway, oh, everybody knew, everybody knew. When Harris was talking about she invites you guys to go to the Trump rally and just watch people leaving Trump rally, that actually hit his ego. Like, Trump was lit. Like, he was lit when she said that. If he could only cuss. <laughs> if he could only cuss. Yeah, that was from YTP, remember guys, to go over, check out his channel, 
and tell them that Spam will send you a course. If you guys enjoy this reaction, drop a like, post the comments down below, share this video with your friends, and also hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, I'm out. They're eating the dogs.